The Commerce Darts League started on the 21st of February this year and will conclude on the 26th of June. The league has six active participating teams in both the men's and the women's divisions, excluding the rustic team that recently joined the league. The local darts league is currently home to 63 registered players in the Comas region, and that number is expected to increase by November. In an interview with DC Darts founder Rhino De Jäger, he stated that the sport is currently pushing to accommodate young people in an attempt to get more players involved in the sport. So the sport is definitely growing. Um, each year upon year, they are we are growing. Um, yeah, so the goal is to get the youth involved, get more people involved, um, try and get sponsors. Um, and yeah, that is the main main goal for the, for DC Darts and Ascoma Darts. NBC Sport also caught up with two Darts teams, Mafia 3 and DC 1, who competed in a league encounter at Wanderers on Wednesday night. I really like Darts because it's one of the few sports where you can do on your own and you can master the skills. Uh, without having fancy equipment, without um, if, you're a, if you're a golfer you need the fancy clubs. Here you just need three pieces of tungsten and it's the same motion over and over again. And if you can be a robot in darts, you're going to be good. It is very competitive. Um, there are different um, levels of, 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 of teams. So tonight Mafia 3 will play against DC 1 which is a very strong team. The Mafia Darts Club will host their third annual dart tournament on the 24th and the 25th of May 2024 at the Windhoek Showgrounds. Christiana Ngobe, NBC Sports, Windhoek.